The first Friday of June every year is celebrated by the people as National Donut Day or Donut Day. The Lassie Salvation Army are the women who served the soldiers during the First World War. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos. The original Donut Salvation Army was first functioned by the Salvation Army ladies in 1917. During the First World War, the Lassies for the Salvation Army were on Europe's front lines. The soldiers were morally encouraged by home cooked food provided by these brave volunteers. The Salvation Army sent a fact finding mission to France shortly after the entry of the United States into World War I in 1917. The mission concluded that canteens, social centers known as the huts, could provide services for baked goods, write goods in stamps, and provide clothing services that could meet the needs of U.S. enlisted men. In general, four volunteers, who could mother the boys, would consist of six staff members per hut. The Salvation Army in the United States established these huts near military training centers. Some 250 volunteers from the Salvation Army came to France. The two volunteers of the Health Army, Ensign Margaret Sheldon and Adjutant Helen Perviance, came up with the idea of providing donuts, given the difficulties of supplying newly made products from huts established in abandoned buildings on the front lines. These were alleged, an immediate hit, and, soon many soldiers visited the huts of the Health Army. Today I made 22 pieces, 300 twigs, 700 cups of coffee, Margaret Sheldon wrote on one busy day. Soon, the women who did this work became known by the servicemen as Donut Girls. In 1938, in honor of the women who served the soldiers in the First World War, the Health Army created the National Donut Day. The day started as a fundraiser for the Salvation Army of Chicago. Their fundraiser in 1938 was intended to assist the needy during the Great Depression. It was a misconception that the supply of the U.S. enlisted men in the First World War with donuts is the source of the term, doughboy, which describes U.S. infantry. The term however had been used since the 1846-1847 Mexican-American War. Volunteers from the Red Cross also distributed donuts during the Second World War and donut dollies were the routine for girls from the Red Cross as well. The Donut Day still serves as a fundraiser for the Salvation Army in Chicago and in other cities. With Russ's Market, Super Saver, Lamar's Donuts, Hertz Donut, and Krispy Kreme, the organization joined the National Donut Day fundraiser in Lincoln, Nebraska and Tempe, Arizona in 2017. In the metal cask of the American soldiers, donuts were often cooked in oil. Then American infantrymen were often referred to as doughboys. The word donut is a more standard spelling. Enjoy your favorite donut, celebrate the day. You can also choose from many different types of donuts. Whether you prefer glazed or creamy, holes or some deliciously prepared donuts, come out and support local bakeries. Take a dozen to deliver your favorite charity to first responders or nursing stations. When using social media, use hashtag National Donut Day or hashtag National Donut Day.